Damn, man. We got some more. Thy lovers more. will mm -hmm. despise thee. Thy will seek thy life. So thy, yeah. they, they will seek thy life. Eventually, the white man gonna despise you. He gonna seek your fucking life, man. Just like in California, when that cop jumped on that nigga woman and started beating her head into the ground, that was a hey. I was I had a, a ball laughing at that bitch, man. Because you know what? They fucking deserve it, man. That's right. Because a woman to stand in your face and talk to you like you ain't shit when you had the power to break that bitch's neck like a piece of bacon, man. No, I, I was looking at him. He looked like a piece of bacon. <laughs> His eyes was all swollen up. You should have oh, seen that it. motherfucker. <laughs> Hey, so I, hey, he looked like a piece of bacon. That's God, what I bro. thought when I seen his face. That motherfucker was you know, how, you know how bacon, you know how bacon bubble all up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, we don't, we don't fuck with bacon. Right, God. But that motherfucker face was, you know. Hey, I, no, I thought, I thought about when I was, uh, when I was at the family get together and all God, my family. God, yeah. Is he not? They, you can tell is he not that pork? They was all swollen up, man. His face all swollen up, eyes. Eyes look Chinese because it's all swollen up, man. Ankles are all swollen up, man. Sick. You know, nigga woman sitting in the wheelchair. Can't die and shit. <laughs> you know? Somebody got, anybody got, got some Yeah, sports? I got some. Go ahead, brother. Go ahead. We're talking about the nigga woman, yeah, man, yeah. today. Nigga, nigga, woman, nigga woman want to scoff and talk shit, man. Well, we're going to give you something to talk about today. Right. Go ahead, brother. I got, um, Sirach, 2516. Mm -hmm. I had rather dwell with a lion and a dragon than to keep house with a wicked woman. Yep. Right. Yep, to keep house with a wicked woman, man. Because a wicked woman will kill you, man. Constantly having to put up with listening to her bullshit. That's stressful, man. It's fucking, it's already stressful, you know what I'm saying, being, being a regular Jake. Hey, um, Paul Mooney said it best. He said I could just walk in the ho in, 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 in the hospital and die, and they'd be like, "Well, how he died?" I was—he was tired of being black. <laughs> he got—he was tired of them yeah, curses, man. Yeah, man. Them curses, man. Go ahead, bro. The wickedness of a woman changes her face and darkeneth her countenance like sackcloth. Yeah, darken her countenance like sackcloth, man. You know. That's why. That's why every every time you go, every time you go out, like like to cash your check and go in the bank, you it's some nigga woman in there looking pissed off, man. And you hoping you don't have to curse this bitch out, man. You know. Only time a nigga woman is happy is when some somebody's talking shit about somebody. Them bitches ain't never just happy. They call it. They call it being messy. You know, that's the only time the fucking black woman is happy when she got a gang of shit to talk about somebody, man. Or when she got a head full of weave and shit, a fresh weave in her head, man. And you know, that's why God don't allow the, 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 the woman of our nation the hair to grow because they too fucking evil, man. That's why they gotta wear somebody else's hair. You don't see, hey, you don't see white women wearing fucking other people's hair. You don't see Chinese women wearing other people's hair. You don't see Arabic women wearing weave. You don't see the women of the other nations wearing weave, man. And you know, and then they get then they get perms so their hair can go out. But what happened when they stop they stop getting the perm? All they fucking hair fall out, bro. They shit fall out without a perm, right? That's, that, that's they fucking, that's their curse. Yeah, talking about I got broken ends. Bitch, right. you you putting fucking mercury on your scalp. What the fuck yeah, you think? A lot of them man? don't even know how to take care of their fucking hair, man. Take you care just, of your hair from the inside You're some dumbass bitches, man. See, it's straight like they, as women, you should know how to take care of your damn hair, man. All right? A white man got in there, you can actually go get somewhat natural products and take care of your shit. Shea butter and shit, man. No, women are fucking lazy. You, you're late. I, I don't want to have to comb my hair. I don't know how to do my hair. You, you know how to do it. She only know how to do it when the shit is straight. That shit done melted everything out of goddamn head, man. I remember back in the day, women used to take hours to get dressed, man. Fixing they self up. 
Now, bitch, just get up and walk out the house, man. Stank shit. With, with pajama pants on and steak and shake, man. Man, that's some Esau shit, bro. I remember the first time I seen that shit, man. I used to see hellbillies doing that shit, man. About five, ten years ago, now I be damn with that. And you got niggas doing the bullshit, man. Niggas walking around this motherfucking SpongeBob fucking pajama pants on, man. That's how fucked up this goddamn society is. Plus, and Jake follows suit, man. Man, Jake could get a fucking SpongeBob Chevy, man. <laughs> fucking pants. <laughs> Should get a whole car painted with SpongeBob on it, man. We riding around thinking that shit cool, man. <laughs> you be wanting to jump in the window and just Superman punch his ass, man. You know what that up? Car sitting up, he about to get clotheslined by the fucking street light. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sitting up on 28. Hey, yeah, bro. Spice Bob Chevy. <laughs> you niggas are idiots, man. You, you're an idiot. Your, your house call, your car costs more than your fucking house. Yeah, man. You sold all this goddamn dope, man, to get, get a car and to have a nice car but live in an apartment. Yeah, man. I, that, remember that green Lincoln we seen? Yeah. I saw it, I yeah. saw it earlier today parked in fucking Delaney, man. Yeah, man. Yeah. In the I know, projects. I know that's a simple nigga. I know that simple ass nigga. It's a simple ass derision military joining ass nigga, man. Yeah, that's all these niggas get when they go to the military is a fucking cop. That's it. It's actually a nice it's a nice Lincoln. <laughs> Well, he just appreciated the, the motherfucker yeah. probably about take about five thousand dollars. I slapped doing that shit on twenty eight. So yeah, shit. <laughs> slap twenty eight on the Lincoln, nigga. Give me a fucking break, man. I actually bought a car. The motherfucker put all that shit on it, man. The fucking front end was fucked up, man. I didn't want the rims. I told him I said I'll just take the car, man. You know, he took the rims off and all that. Man, I had so much fucking work to do to the front end, man. Ball joints is all fucked up. You fuck a car, we put them big ass wheels on. Yeah, man. But you know what they do that shit? They do that shit to go get some fucking slut that been fucked all day. Come on, right, brother. And then, then sprayed some body works on bath and body works so she can smell good. Hope, hope, hope fumes. Yeah, man. Hope, hope fumes. <laughs> this, uh, you got some more out? You done? Go ahead, bro. 18. Her husband shall sit among his neighbors, mm -hmm. and when he heareth it, shall sigh bitterly. Yeah, man. Oh, when that bitch call you on her phone, her, her name pop up on the phone, you having a good time with your boys, you don't get happy to see that bitch on your phone. You be like, what the fuck does she want? What? God damn, I can't even have an hour. You know, you be with, you be with, hey, you be with, you be with your, your, uh, your, your, your brothers. Well, you know, I don't want to say homies. That's some nigga on the street terminology. You, we be, we be around each other for hours and lose track of time. You be with your woman, you be like, it's 11 o'clock, you gotta work tomorrow. Ain't you gonna go to sleep, bitch? <laughs> huh? Ain't it bedtime? Shut the fuck up. You know? Because a nigga want to talk too much. And then a man is not interested in the conversation of a woman because it's all drama. It's all dramatic, man. It's all fucking drama, man. All the woman gotta talk about is drama. Bringing you down with her bullshit. I don't see how they do that shit. That fucking, man, these women are fucking loony bins, man. How can you sit and listen all day to somebody talk about a bunch of negative bullshit and you be happy as hell? Yeah, girl, be A, hey, man. I would've told that bitch, you know, go fuck yourself. You know? And then you all charged up on that negativity and shit and bring it home to your husband and want to start an argument with him. But fuck, I don't give a fuck, yeah. You know? But we, he can't get up and knock your fucking teeth down your throat, man. That's the problem. That's what needs to be fixed. That part needs to be fixed, man. You know? Now, women are so fucking bitter and lonely, now they on the comment boards too. That's bullshit you're talking about. I knew, I, I know this the bitch love cats. Come on, that's she on the she on the comment board talking, scoffing too, because she got a bitter life, man. The majority of these suck, these black women got a bitter fucking life, man. Right. And their husband are even more bitter, man, because he got to deal with her shit all day, man. Right. He leave the house. What the, where you at? What the hell you was at? <laughs> you know. I gotta deal with that bullshit all day, man. I was I was out fucking fucking uh, another bitch, okay? It's over. Thank you. Come on, boy, say it. Hard, 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 hard
the motherfucker and say, hey, 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 that's dead, y'all. I'm never coming home again. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> it's over. Thank you, bitch. <laughs> I've been trying to hear you say that for the last three months. <laughs> you know? Yo, I got something off. Uh, you know, Jake be, hey, Jake be sticking with the bits because, cause, you know, he got the in-house pussy, you know, right, you're right, like, right. Nah, whatever. But you know what? A relationship ain't about how much you love somebody no more. It's about how much shit you can put up with, yeah, man. Yeah. It's not about how much you care and love about that person, want to see them happy. No, nobody want to see nobody happy in this bitch. <laughs> hey. Miserable. You trying to make the other motherfucker miserable. Yeah, niggas do not want to see niggas happy. Cut the, cut the bullshit, man. No, niggas do, you don't want to see nobody happy, bitch. And if it's not yourself, it damn sure ain't going to be him. You know? Niggas got that cooning spirit, man. Mama boy niggas, man. They're raised by their mother all fucking all their fucking life and taught to kiss a woman's ass, man. But my, hey, man, hey, I, I, <laughs> hey, my, my pops would tell my mom, shut up, and she would go in the room and be quiet, man. Now you tell a woman, shut up. Ah, she got, she, I call the police, I kill you. I do all this shit to you. And you can't do nothing to her. Because you know what? Even if she was starting an argument and hitting you and, and, and scarring you, you know what I'm saying, scratch you and cut you, the police get there like, what are you, what are you scared of a woman? I, hey, if, you know, and then you don't have the right to hit the bitch back. What do you gotta do? You gotta stand here and hold this bitch like a fucking baby while she trying to fucking kill you, man. And and ninety percent of the time they don't arrest that hoe. They tell you to leave. Hey, well just let her calm down. Just let her calm down. You know, ain't no order in this society, man. Ain't no ain't no order. This society is not built up on order. Cause if, if the society if this society was built up on order, these people would be in check, man. Everybody would know their place. You know, but in America, everybody's free to do what they want to do, which is not the will of the Lord, man. You know, man, a man is supposed to be able to go to work and come home to peace in his fucking house, man. Not to no nagging, arguing bitch every day, man. But you know what? We the only nation that deal with that. Only the only nation that got to deal with that is a so-called black man. Go ahead, all wickedness is but little to the wickedness of a woman. There you have it, man. All wickedness, man, that's I, I was I was looking for that scripture when you get it earlier, man. All wickedness is but little to the wickedness of a woman, man. What do you say? Let what? Let the portion of a sinner fall upon her. Yeah, man, let up be the fucking sin, man. But you know what? Hey, the Lord put us as a hand, so we gotta catch it too, man. Letting this bitch get out of check, man. Hey, hey. You know? You got something? Yeah, I got some. You want some more to that? I need y'all to stand and get a second picture. No, thank you. Y'all don't take it? No, no, no. Get off. Go on YouTube. We're on, we're on YouTube. Go on YouTube. All right, I got you back. Go on here, we. As they're climbing up. A sandy way is the feet of the age. So is a wife full of words to a quiet man. So is a wife full of words to a quiet man. You know? You know, women talk women talk a hell of a lot of shit. And and, and, and you know what? Hey, they say the one the quiet ones will fuck you up, man. You wonder why wonder why they just found this bitch in the trunk of a car the other day. You know? This flight attendant. Did you hear about that flight attendant that she got found in the trunk of a car, man? You know what? She probably was running her fucking mouth and somebody got tired. That's what they think. Talking about she was vivacious and lively. I bet she was. <laughs> now she didn't. Yeah. <laughs> you got some more that? That's, you know what? Hey. Bro, hey. This bitch had a beard, bro. Yeah, she did. She looked like, like Easy e, e sisters. Like, yeah, she she probably like a motherfucker. She looked like Easy e. e. Her hormone was raging, just like the brother just said, man. Yeah, man. Sure. 
Nah, bitch, get the fuck out of here. Bitch, you tried to come off some authority stuff. I need y'all to move out again. Like, what the fuck? What the fuck? Hey, what the fuck? Kick up my ass. Your ass is doing this. Bitch, my fucking motherfucking yeah. whiskers. Beat off Street, your bitch. Beat <laughs> Street. Get the fuck out of here. Stumble not at the beauty of a woman and desire her not for pleasure. You know, because the prettier the, prettier the woman is, the more fucked up she is, man. You know, you take me, oh, that's a bad bitch, look at her body. Because you know, Jake, men are visual, man. Jake, men are visual, I, I mean, men are visual. They look at they look at a woman, you know what I'm saying, she got a nice looking face, nice body, man be like, yeah. And, and man be prepared to deal with her bullshit so they can, you know, you know, the cosmos, tell them, tell them what they want to hear, all that shit, you know. We be prepared to deal with their bullshit because of their looks. And you know, they know that that's what we want, man. They know, you know, a woman ain't just gonna up and give you no pussy. She wants you to kiss a little ass first, man. I don't, that's why I don't chase women no more. I don't be in the streets like that no more because I don't have the patience to deal with that shit no more. Bitch, I'm gonna keep it real with you. Hey, I wanna fuck. Oh, hey, do you wanna fuck? No, okay. I wanna fuck. <laughs> I mean, how, how, how hard is it, man? But Jay could go so far as trying to save the bitch's life and all kind of crazy ass shit, man. Park his car and help the bitch cross the help the bitch carry, carry groceries and shit. You know, Jake, Jake a bunch of fucking ass kissing, man. That bitch independent. Yeah, man, let that bitch carry on. Hope she fall and break her fucking neck on the way up, man. You, we 12 to 1. If you lose one fine bitch, it's a bunch of them. To, hey, man. Yeah. <laughs> I was hoping this gun went off and kill that bitch. That police officer, when he jumped on that, start beating her face in, man. Go ahead, read. 22. A woman, if she maintain her husband, is full of anger. Yep, man. If you ain't got, if you fall on hard times, man, you know, they, and you know, and, and niggas go and get married and take these vows and shit with these women, knowing they ain't gonna fucking keep them, man. These women ain't gonna keep these vows. If you fall on hard times and you got a woman, she gonna fucking leave your ass. Or either she's gonna stay with you and start fucking another man that can pay some bills around the house. That's how it goes. But ain't no bitch gonna be like, oh, well, I'm gonna stay. You know, hey, that year used to be like that. It used to be like that, because my, my, my pops fell on hard times, and my mother wouldn't got another job, man. You no, know, my, my mom's wouldn't got another job, man, because that's what kind of woman she was, man. She didn't want the house to fall apart. But now, now, they've given bitches child support now. Now bitch be like, oh, thank you, leave. And, and you know what, and then, then when the nigga come busting their house and steal their shit, then they want to call you back. Bitch, fuck you. Go ahead, read. It's full of anger, impudence, and much reproach. Yeah, man, a woman, if she take, she gotta take care of you, man. She gonna treat you like shit, man. You know, it may be a couple of weeks where this bitch be like, well, he gonna get a job eventually. You know, he gonna get a job. You know, but eventually, you know, a certain period of time go past, she gonna start to, to shit on you and treat you like shit. No? Go ahead. A wicked woman abated the cordage, naked and heavy countenance. Abated the courage, man. You know? You know, cause, cause you know, when you around a, you around a wicked woman. You know what I'm saying? And she, and you, you don't, you don't want to hear her mouth. So eventually, you will stop talking shit to her just so, just so you don't have to hear her fucking mouth, man. That's why, that's why I say abated the courage, man. Cause you'll take her bullshit and be like, well, I don't want to hear this bitch. I don't want to hear this bitch mouth. So I'm, I'm gonna just leave and go for a ride and get away from this bitch so she can calm the fuck down. Then maybe when I get back, the bitch will leave me the fuck alone. Cause, Cause you can't do nothing. If you start yelling with the bitch, eventually, you know what I'm saying? If you're a man and you start getting a yelling match with the bitch, eventually you gonna grab the bitch and wanna, you gonna get physical. Cause we can't do the shit that women do. We can't sit up here and yell back and forth for the motherfucker all day. You know, with most men, it's eventually time for action. We either gotta leave and go calm ourselves down and try to let you calm down. But if we stay there, eventually we're gonna be ready to bounce you off the fucking ceiling. You know? But it, hey, go ahead, we. And a wounded heart. <laughs> yeah. She abated the courage. 
make it what? evil, man. Make it an heavy countenance and a wounded heart. Yeah, man, make it a wounded heart. Man. So what a man do when he deal with a woman like that? He stop giving a fuck about her. When, when they break up, then when you get to the, with the next woman, he don't really give a fuck about her. Because he's been, been through so much shit with the last one, he expected her to shit on him too. So really, he can't, he can't really care about the bitch, a bitch no more, man. Because he got that conflict within himself. Go ahead. A woman that will not comfort her husband in distress maketh weak hands and feeble knees. Man, that's a fucking nigga woman, man. Hell yeah. You, man, you, you could tell, you could tell him, oh, bitch, my, hey, hey, bitch, my mother died. And that bitch started comparing shit to her life. Yeah, I remember when my grandmother died, and, you know. You know, that bitch, that bitch would steal the spotlight from your ass. And still saying, oh, baby, oh, that's so sad. You know, women used to do that shit. That era is over. I remember my grandmother died. I just, hey, you know, I just thought about the good times. Got me a drink. All right, see you later. I got to go to work. <laughs> you know, bitch used to call off work. I, I had a death in the family. <laughs> And your mother died. That bitch be like, okay. I didn't like the bitch anyways. Yeah. Hey, hey, a bitch, a bitch would get, uh, gather enough nerve to say that, man. If they ain't really like her. Bring up all the bad times you got into with your mother and mm -hmm. shit. Remember that time she put us out? Mm -hmm. I wouldn't be crying over that bitch. Yeah, man. <laughs> That's when a woman you religious, were. maybe God didn't want on her. Maybe she wasn't sure. But you know, they, they can be a fucking evil demon all day, but ain't God ain't got nothing to do with it. <laughs> <laughs> hey, women hate each, each fucking other, man. Women hate each other, man. Nah, they do, bro. Nah, they do. That motherfuckers can't get it, man. You put women in, you put women in a room alone, Three days, somebody gonna fucking fuck around and die, man. Somebody down. They, them bitches hate each other, boy. They, hey, they, they, what the fuck you mean? They, 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 and through her, we all died. The woman came to be, bitch, you went off first. I ain't know it was the man's fault. Bitch, you made that decision on your own. Just like they do now, man. Yeah, your, man. your woman will make a total decision without you, man. Yeah, you know, yeah man. A major decision, man. And, and, and when it all exploded in her face, she was looking for you to help her, man. I done dealt with this shit, man. Yeah, man, hell yeah. And, I'll be, and I'll be looking at the bitch like this. Why the fuck did you do well, he say you need, man, mm -hmm. that, that, hey, man, they don't just let, prove that Eve. Man. Yeah, man, don't let the bitch get no money, no yep. big sample money, hey. She just let people brawl, brawl. Uh, yeah, yeah, man. They want you to go try to collect this shit back. This yeah. bitch out buying Gucci <laughs> belts and Jordans and shit. Car engine light on. <laughs> wow, she's hey, car engine light on. She driving that motherfucker like hell, going to get a fucking, fucking, uh, uh, what is that? Uh, uh, be a uh, go to Gabbana bag and all that shit, man. Another air hat. Yeah, man. A lace frame. Get a scalp peeled. <laughs> go ahead, read. Give the water no passage. Mm -hmm. Neither a wicked woman liberty to gad abroad. Yeah, now you see what happens when you do that. Now you got to pounce on the bitch and beat her face in. There was another recent one. The police officer, the police officer had the bitch in custody, um, had a had an um, solitary confinement. You know what I'm saying? Eventually, she talked enough shit to the police officer, came in there and start just broke the bitch down, man. Slammed her face on the fucking uh, concrete bench, man, and put his knee in her back and was whispering in her ear. I know you're saying, "Say something now, bitch. Go on here, say something now." These cameras ain't got no no audio, bitch. Fuck you. I don't feel like I'm gonna die. If you gonna die, then go ahead. You in jail, bitch. You don't got no rights. <laughs> hey, hey, police officers, they've been killing, they've been killing people recently. They've been getting off like a motherfucker. Yeah, yeah. He got suspended for one week. I'm like, oh, the world is in there. <laughs> hey, this motherfucker gets suspended for one week. He didn't shot a motherfucker in cold blood. And then, then you go to 
they're in the court, and the court is a fucking joke. You go to court, and you're innocent to you. to prove guilty. It don't seem that fucking way to me. But hey man, this fucking devil will say any fucking thing, man. You're innocent to proving guilty. Well, why the fuck am I locked up then? Right. <laughs> well, you gotta wait till your court date comes. But if I'm innocent, why the fuck am I in here? Not that clear, hey, niggas be all up in his ass, don't they? Uh, so I gotta do the right thing, hey, man. Don't rob that white man, the police gonna get you. No, rob that nigga over there. Yeah, See, they don't yeah. give a fuck about him. <laughs> They're gonna kill all these motherfuckers. Especially his mm -hmm. mm -hmm. I wish I could have tied some razor wire <laughs> across the street from Paul yeah, Paul. And like they did in Iraq, and all them, watched all them motherfuckers' head pop up in there like popcorn. Pull that, pull that motherfucker soon as she had about to pass so. Hey, they did that, they did that overseas. Mm -hmm. Them motherfuckers riding in them tanks. They're messing that shit. And they'll tie a piece of wire at night, they'll tie wire from pole to pole, and them motherfuckers be getting their heads chopped off. <laughs> That's what they did in a uh, wrong turn, too. Yeah. Yeah, man. Good time with this silly ass shit, see? Ooh. I bet these motherfuckers think they tough on these bikes. Probably ain't got a hundred dollars in his bank account. That's thrown on the profit. <laughs> <laughs> Let's show him something that's really cool. Yeah, wait till gas get up to eight dollars. He gonna be riding them over in the winter. <laughs> it ain't no ice out there. Ah, shit. <laughs> your woman gonna still have my car. You gonna hey. Ride your bike. <laughs> Jobless nigga, get a job then. <laughs> Get another job. Women ain't gonna stick with you for nothing in that day. Hell no, bro. These bitches gonna, gonna fuck, hey. They're gonna fail. I'm going They're to gonna go be like, uh -huh. um, gas $8, you gotta move out. What? I'm getting the chip, baby. Bitch, we just got married. I'm, hey. Hard time. Sorry, I should've seen you wasn't shit when I married you. <laughs> hey, hey, hey women will say some shit like that. All up, bro. Hey, women can say some fucking cruel ass shit, man. Women will say some shit like that. I witness, hey, I witness, Bitches say shit like that. My grandmother was fucking evil. She the fucking church mother of Indiana. Motherfucker went to my went to my great grandmother's funeral and said she could sure get some money out of you. She had Jew you to death. Hey. On the microphone in front of everybody. I said, bitch, you a cold bitch. <laughs> you a cold bitch coming in and say some shit like that. This woman laying there dead. <laughs> Go fall and kill yourself. Man, I don't know him either. Hey, you probably think we cool. See, they, see everybody want to be a part of something, but don't nobody want to put in the work. Jake don't want to put in the work, bro. I got a glass, bro. Yeah? <laughs> yeah, he's gone, bro. He's gone. That's why you didn't see him. about earlier today who I see the videos. You said what? That's one of them niggas who said, uh, who you were talking about earlier who see the videos. Yeah, man. They see us. I hope you see this one, man. What's that a handful of rocks to throw in front of your ass? Some <laughs> <laughs> <The> marbles. <laughs> Get scraped. Come on here, Reed. If she go as the wouldest, I mean, if she go not as the wouldest have her, cut her off from thy flesh, mm -hmm. and give her a bill of divorce, and let her go. Yeah, women don't want. Hey, women don't want. Don't know what they want. Hey, you, that's what you're supposed to do. Cut her off, you know, let her ass go, man. If she's giving you so many problems, man, let her fuck, cut her the fuck loose, man. You know? Ain't no fucking, we ain't kissing no ass out here, man. Fuck that bitch, let her go. But a bitch, a bitch will, 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 will wanna break up with you and then see that she ain't got shit going and then this be all of it sucking up your ass and shit. Oh, please. Oh, well, hey, if I can get some pussy, I guess, you know, you can keep coming around. But just shut the fuck up. Really. <laughs> you know, hey, if you wanna if you wanna pop the bitch, keep her around, that's cool. That's up to you. You the man, you know. And eventually that bitch is gonna cause you. You're gonna you end up putting bands on that bitch. Yeah man. Yeah. Tell you, you're gonna keep you're gonna keep fucking with her and cut that bitch off. Yeah man. 
because the nigga woman ain't shit. But you know what? Remember, the next one you get ain't gonna be shit either. Yeah, yeah. Calm. Calm, hey, man. What, what pick do I got? It's trash. <laughs> they're like a they're like a bunch of rusty pennies, man. Which one of these motherfuckers am I gonna spend today? <laughs> I got some, bro. <laughs> You got something too, bro. Hey, that's, that's the that's, hey, that's, that's the worth trash, of a nigga yeah. woman, a rusty penny. Man. That's a penny that fell under the dryer in the, in the washer rack, been under that for about 15 <laughs> years. That's trash, yeah, man. man. That's when they were throwing the garbage all that's out the over there. That's yeah, yeah, the trash lady. Look, she taking a wash up with a bottle of water. <laughs> she, <laughs> that bitch mad at life. Yeah, remember she was throwing the trash out over there? It's a, uh, it's a uh, Isaiah 32 and nine. <laughs> it's uh, Isaiah 32 and nine. He said, "Rise, rise up, ye women that are at ease. Mm -hmm. Hear my voice, ye careless daughters." Hey, that's Jake, man. The nigga woman is a careless fucking woman. That's right. She don't give a fuck about nothing but fucking shopping and bullshit, man. Shopping, different dicks, you know. That's 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 a nigga woman. That's what she's result to, man. A fucking hole in the ground. Go ahead. Uh, give ye careless daughters, give ear to uh, to my speech. Mm -hmm. Many days and years shall ye be troubled. That's what I was talking about earlier. When I said, look, I, I don't want to just kill the bitch. I want them to suffer, man. Yeah. I want the bitch to be troubled. No, but even even when they go in the spirit world, they're gonna be like, damn, I was fucking up. Yeah. But when they leave this body, they're gonna be so happy to leave out this body, but they're gonna be like, damn, I was a fucked up person, man. I was fucked up, man. Because you know, people gonna come back with, to everlasting shame and contempt, man. Go ahead, read. Do it. Many days and years shall you be troubled. Do it for the music. You, ca you careless <laughs> women, for the vintage shall fail. And gathering shall not come. Yep, the vintage is going to fail. All this food stamps and, and uh, 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 um, what's that child shit? Support. Child support, man. Social security checks Social from your, security from your dead drug selling boyfriend. <laughs> and the, all the babies he put up in you. You know, all this shit is about to fail, man. Soon, soon, man, you bitches going to be trouble, man. And what, hey, hey, hey. We're gonna see who's Zena the warrior princess when that day come, man. Who could fucking hunt and catch fish, man? Cause you know, last time I checked, all these women are squeamish. You throw a worm on a bitch, that bitch will fucking kill herself trying to get it off. <laughs> I used to do that shit when I was little. I used to catch fucking beetles and throw them, and that mother, that bitch will catch flight in midair and be in all of that bitch hair and shit. That bitch will beat the fuck out of herself, man. You know? We're gonna see what happens when it comes time for you to find food, man. You women are gonna resort straight to selling pussy, man. Shit. And if you got a little child, you're gonna eat that motherfucker. They're gonna be getting pussy too. That's all they gonna do. Yeah, they're gonna be getting pussy too. But you know what? They're gonna be trying to sell it. Yeah. They're gonna be trying to sell it. Hey, man, these women, these women, man, hey, they fall on hard times. Hey, they got a pussy. And you know what? Women are not teaching the women to be holy. They teaching women if you got a pussy, then you can you supposed to have some money. That's right. That's not righteous, man. So basically they tell you go sell your pussy, man. That shit ain't fucking righteous. I know I know women whose mothers told them that shit, man. Yeah. What the fuck man, you got? What the fuck your purse drive for? You got a pussy. I ain't no nigga who ain't got no good credit. <laughs> man, these fucking nigga women, man. These fucking man. Man, Lord, let this place go down, man. Let this place go down. I got a list of bitches. I'm a chin check, man, and fuck up, man. I'm a kid. I'm a. I'm a. I'm a hit that bitch. I'm a jaw that bitch and knock out and just jump up and down on that bitch back as high as I can jump, man. Namely, that bitch that was on the comic board. Yeah, man. Her. <laughs> Tell ass bitch. Her. A, a, a bunch of more women that I know, man. Talking shit, man. Just cause you, just, just cause you can, man. Hey, man, these times it's about to get real fucking rugged, man. It's about to get no holes barred in this bitch, man. 
That's what, hey, the scriptures say, war unto you that laugh. The majority of people that walk, ride past and laugh are women. See, that nigga just, nigga, that one nigga talking about do it for the van. Yeah, man. Hey, that, that nigga truck leaning back like he, like he, like he I looking that, for a van. I told that nigga, uh, do it for the nuclear fire. Yeah, man. Yeah, this is what he just did. Just mark himself for the nuclear fire. You know? Niggas are simple as hell, man. Some more that, bro? Yep. Tremble, ye women that are at ease. Mm -hmm. Be troubled, ye careless ones. But you ain't gonna do that now. See? You ain't gonna read. Ain't no woman gonna stumble upon that in the, in the Bible and say, Ooh, that's, I'm cut. <laughs> <laughs> You're not gonna hear that shit. They're gonna be like, I don't think that's what that means. You got you got the wrong interpretation of what's going on. But I think it's a bunch of bullshit. You know? Hey, that's Jake though, period. Jake always got something to say. But it ain't all the way right though. You know? Jake always. He said, be troubled, you careless ones. Strip you and make you bare. Mm -hmm. And gird up sackcloth upon your loins. That means, hey, hey, you're supposed to be crying, man. You're supposed to be troubled. Because when the Lord is coming back with death, man. The Lord is coming back with death, man. You know? Ain't no ain't time for celebration, man. Ain't no fucking time for celebration, man. you know? Jake want to be a part of anything but this, man. This, yeah. Now you know, know that the who put that spirit in him. That's why the Lord said, who shall rise up for me against the evildoers, man. You know, and them niggas in them churches ain't doing it, man. Mm-hmm. Pastor Adultery ain't doing it, man. <laughs> you know? Hey man, hey man, you ever seen any other nation of women with fucking weave in their hair? Yeah. No, no man. And you know what? Everybody, hey, everybody, everybody waiting to sell their hair to the black woman. <laughs> they'll sell, hey, they'll go buy that shit for two hundred dollars <laughs> and wear somebody else shit. <laughs> Ain't got a gang of shit to say. You know? Hey, Why it's. I heard. It's rare that you see a nigga woman with their hair, bro. Very rare. Ain't nobody else doing that shit. You know what? Hey, little, uh, the little Ephraimite, the little Ephraimite in the hood. Yeah. Hey, he growing his hair out. Yeah. You know, yeah. The little, Sell it for five hundred dollars. He said he said he can cut his hair off and sell sell two locks of his hair for two hundred dollars. Yeah. And he got seven locks. Yeah. One hundred dollars a lock. And who is the hair gonna go to? The nigga woman. They're gonna paint that shit black and put it on the nigga woman's head. Or put it on a wig for the nigga woman. Goddamn shit. Women ain't, man, women, a woman's supposed to be, our women's supposed to be teaching the younger women how to be fucking women, man. But they not teaching them. They talking about, oh, girl, like you ain't got no fight. money, you better go suck some dick. I get a Titus second chapter. These, these fucking black women don't know how to be mothers, man. They think that yelling at their child or cursing them out every day is being a fucking mother, man. And collecting food stamps and shit, that's being a fucking mother. 
Wow, that's the hardest job in the world. Collect food stamps, sit on your ass and collect food stamps and child support all fucking day. You know, hey, but if, if, if a man takes custody of his kids, they, he'll have a hard time getting that shit, man. they give him hell, man. And I don't know no bitches paying fucking child support, man. Brother, they got see this child, man. They couldn't get y'all's boy. That's some boy. That shit is that shit is a farce, man. That's why you know this motherfucker is geared to the fucking nigga. Hey, they, uh, hey, that's strategically, like I said, strategically. Hey, that's strategically keeping us out of order, man. Keeping our women out of order. Man. You know, Esau don't want our women to be in order because Esau wants to pop our women. Them white boy is cute. <laughs> <laughs> he got a Benz, girl. You know, and these white men know that they get good. They these white men grow their boys up and buy them a new car and send them right to the right to the uh, nigga club, man. And say you gonna get some pussy tonight. Tonight we gonna break you in. You 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 been with a you been with a nigga woman before? Like the dude who said on Monsters Balls, you ever been with a nigga woman? What do he do? He went out and got him a nigga woman. Chapter 7, verse 10. Then she that is my enemy shall see it. Mm -hmm. She that is my fucking enemy, man. These women not with us, man. They just here for us to, to get a little a little bit of comfort that, is, that you can get in this place. Possibly. Which ain't no comfort because you don't catch you don't catch double the hell that you get comfort, man. And she shall cover with and she and shame shall cover her which said unto me where is the Lord thy power yeah where, where's your where, where's this this great time of destruction that you keep talking about when is that gonna happen you better go and get a job nigga you better go get a better job and get a car where's your God <laughs> you a false prophet <laughs> it's the nigga woman. Hey, the nigga woman uh, 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 try, uh, try to get spiritual, man. And know, and don't know it's in the Bible that, that, I mean, know it's in the Bible that you're not supposed to raise up against your man. You know? All that is folly, man. These women talking shit to their men. That's fucking folly. Man. And the Lord's gonna, hey, and just because you with a, a, a man that's righteous don't mean you're gonna be delivered, man. That shit, I, hey, man, women think, oh, Hey, 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 I, I was childbearing. You know, that don't mean that you're gonna get delivered. The Lord could kill your ass anyway, man. The Lord could kill that child and kill you, man. You know? Hey, man, it's a fearful thing to fall into the hands of the living power, man. Ain't no celebration about having no, having no seed in the earth, bro. That shit, man, is fucking scary. Believe me, it's fucking scary. Go ahead, we. Where is thy Lord, thy power? Mm -hmm. My eyes shall behold her. Now shall she be trotting down as the mire of the streets. Yep. We're gonna, hey, we're gonna jump up and down. We're gonna try you down like, like shit, man. Like wet dirt, man. You know. Hey, hey, don't nobody give a fuck about dirt. You know, we, we don't we don't turn back and apologize to the dirt we walked over. It's fucking dirt. That's how they're gonna be treating these women out here. They gonna they gonna take all the pussy they want from you, and then and and you and you gonna expect them to take you in, man? They gonna be like, bitch, get the fuck away from me. Turn around, beat the fuck out of you. I can already tell that spirit is coming in the earth, man, because I, I can't feel I can't feel no remorse for no woman, man. I can't feel I can't feel no no love and no compassion for no fucking woman, man. That spirit that spirit is coming in the earth, man. But men is men are gonna be vicious to fucking women, man. 
he, men are gonna be fucking vicious to you, man. And, and you're gonna deserve every fucking bit of it, man. You know, just cause I, I, I stick with the woman, you know, hey. You know, I got a woman, you know what I'm saying? I care for the bitch, but I don't love her. Cause she not right. No, but if you with so you with somebody for so long, you gonna have feelings for them, you know. But as far as me trying to reciprocate and 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 relate to her problems and all that shit, I don't be giving a fuck about that shit. <laughs> like, I had a hard day at work. I, I have a hard day every day, bitch. I have a hard day waking up, bitch. When I before you went to work, I had a hard sleep last night. You know. I don't have no remorse for you, man. And I'm definitely not gonna have no remorse when your ass start getting stumped out in these streets, man. When the cops start batoning your ass. Cause you deserve every fucking bit of it, man. You know? When you little, when you little fucking uh, babies catch Ebola, man. <laughs> hey, y'all see that shit that's going on in Africa, man? That fucking, it's, that, 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 shit, that pandemic that's going on over there, Ebola virus, man. It's killing motherfuckers, man. It's only been over there for a couple of months and it's killed 400 people, man. And they said another 400 got it. Hey, it's, hey, it's a scary fucking times we living in, yeah, man. Hey, that shit gotta be airborne, bro. Man, it's fucking scary, bro. Is that basically? Is that basically in the car? Yeah, this bitch is going to my truck. Look at the fucking nigga on it, man. Oh, he finna hurt that bitch. Watch for police. Sit this thing, man. You got it. Sit this thing, man. No, she actually leaning in it. It, she, she, down? it ain't down, but she like she looking around and, and stuff. Yeah. Hey, with that, we're gonna say all praise to Hell by Shimmy on the side. Double honors to the L's, the GMS. Shalom to all you brothers that's being pushing this truth. Sincerity, man. You know, we're gonna get the fuck out of here soon, Lord willing. Hell by Shimmy on the side, Brock and Thunder to your brothers, man. Shalom. Shalom.